Are you looking for the best video editing apps for Android right now? Well, good news. This is our 2023 review of all the best Android video editors for smartphone and tablet. I'm gonna share my top picks for all types of video creators from free and beginner friendly apps up to more advanced options so that you can find the one that's right for you. And let me know your favorite app down in the comments below. So if you've ever checked out the Play Store for video editing apps, you know that there is a lot of options. You've got things like Adobe Rush, InShot, PowerDirector, CapCut, VN Video Editor, VLLO, LumaFusion, now on Android, which is awesome. KineMaster, UCut, Splice, Quick, Filmora, QCut, Video Leap, and Motion Ninja. So after spending a ton of time trying and testing all the top options, I've narrowed this down to a short list of my top three editing apps right now. And those are CapCut, VLLO, or VLO, and LumaFusion. Now before I share my number one top pick, let's take a look at each one of these in a little more detail to help you decide which is the right one for you. So the first one is CapCut. Now this decision to add CapCut in here was a really tough one because there's a few different apps out there that are very, very similar. And in terms of features, there's still pros and cons of each of them. VN Video Editor, for instance, is another one that I'm a really big fan of. It does do some things better than CapCut, like you'll get more control over your export settings in VN Video Editor. But the overall interface, the usability, the design, they're very, very similar. And I personally think that for right now, CapCut is the better option all round. So getting to it then, CapCut is an amazing free video editing app for Android, for iOS, for Windows and for Mac. It's now on desktop too. And it's really amazing all the features and stuff that you get access to in here for free. So like I said, the overall interface, the experience and editing in here, it is really intuitive. It is really easy to use. It's really fast and fluid as well. So if you haven't edited before and you're diving in here, you're gonna be able to figure it out pretty quick and be able to get some great videos edited fast. Now CapCut's actually created by the company ByteDance who also make TikTok. So there's a heap of extra effects and filters and things in here that make it easy to create great looking TikToks, but also great looking videos for other platforms too. It's got some really cool features like background removal. It's got a really powerful AI transcribing tool where it will write out and convert to text everything that is said in your video. And it's also got a built-in video stabilizer as well to help you fix your shaky footage. Now while it does have a lot of filters and effects that you can easily apply to your videos in there, it really doesn't have too many pro level features or controls if you're someone that's looking for that. But I do think it's an amazing all-rounder whether you've never created a video before or whether you're looking to create really fast engaging videos or short edits, I think CapCut could be a really good option for you. Next up is VLLO. Now this is another one that has a very similar interface to CapCut to VN Video Editor, but it does have some standout more professional features too. So yeah, the overall interface again is really intuitive, really easy to use, really fast to edit and find everything in. And I really love how easy it is to switch between the different stages of your editing with the menu bar along the bottom. So you can quickly jump between audio, graphics, text, picture in picture and effects, and it's gonna customize up the layout to help you focus on those specific areas, all while you can still focus on that same area of your edit or view your entire timeline. I really like the on-screen guides that help you resize and reframe your shots. And I also love that you've got access to ripple edit tools in here, so stuff that you'd find on more professional video editing desktop software that make it so quick and easy for you to cut down a bunch of footage really, really quickly. I also really like the way that you can apply filters and color grades, where they're essentially added as an adjustment layer. So you don't need to go and apply those settings to each one of your clips or copy and paste them. You can literally drag that layer out over all the clips you want to affect, and it's going to apply those to them. Again, features that you would normally only find in more professional editing tools. Now, in terms of pricing, there is a free version, but the one that I would strongly recommend is the premium version which is available as either a subscription or you can pay currently $25.99 for lifetime access to those premium features. So I think it's awesome that for those of you that don't like the subscription model and would rather just pay once, then you've got that option here. And it's incredibly cheap considering what you're getting access to. So I think it's a really good option, again, for someone who could be an absolute beginner because it's also intuitive and easy to use, but also for someone that's looking for some of the more advanced features and functionality than you would get in something like CapCut. So the third one, that's where LumaFusion comes in. So LumaFusion is hands down the most professional video editing app on Android and iOS. 
I am so pumped that this is finally out on Android. It's been one of my top picks on iPhone and iPad for a long time. So yes, at the time of filming this, it is out on Android, but it is out currently in beta. So you'll probably find that it's only gonna be available for you if you've got one of the more recent devices or a flagship device. If you've got an older one, then hopefully it will come to you a little later. But this is by far the most professional video editing tool on Android. And it really mimics what you would find in professional desktop video editing software. Now the overall interface and the usability is still really easy to use. It's still fairly intuitive. It's definitely not as easy as a VLLO or as a CapCut but that's also because there is just so much more in there. I was so impressed with the power and the performance in there on Android, just as it is on iOS, but having the ability to edit professional grade video files, high resolution, high bitrate video files, and just have it cut through it like butter is just crazy. And to have that on an Android device is so awesome. Now, personally, I love that you can customize up the overall interface. So if you're not using this on a larger screen, you can still work really, really well on your phone as well because you can switch between different presets or different layouts depending on what you wanna focus on. So if your focus is on editing, you can make the timeline bigger. If your focus is on effects and titles, then you can switch the layout to make that easier, all to maximize that screen real estate. But I do think for the best experience, you wanna be using it on a larger device, a tablet, or even a Chromebook. And I personally haven't tested it yet, but I've heard it works really, really well on Samsung DeX 2. So not only do you get access to all the professional video editing tools, there's also some really powerful color grading, also audio tools and filters and effects and things in there as well. I also personally love the amount of control you get over things like your export settings, where you can really dial everything in and customize things up to get exactly what you're after. Now, in regards to pricing, there is no no free version of LumaFusion. It is a paid app and it's currently selling for $19.99 as a one-time flat rate fee while it's in open beta. Once it moves out of open beta, then the full price will go to $29.99, which is where it's at on iOS and still ridiculously cheap considering what you're getting access to. So I personally love that it's a one-time fee and not another subscription. So I think LumaFusion is a great option for anyone who is looking for the most amount of control, the most amount of features, really pro level tools for video editing on an Android device. So it'd be great for someone if you're gonna be creating longer form videos, but even if you are an absolute beginner and you're someone who wants to invest a little bit of time to learn professional grade software, then this could be a great option for you too. So for me personally, if I am gonna do a really quick edit for Instagram or Instagram stories, then I generally find myself jumping straight into CapCut. I think it's a great mix of being fast and easy to use with enough features and effects in there to do something that looks good really, really quickly. But for other longer or more detailed videos, that's really where now I'm open up LumaFusion. So it really is a tough call and it is gonna come down to you personally, the types of videos you're making, your skill set. But if I did have to pick one overall winner, best all rounder, right now it's gonna to go to LumaFusion. I'm an absolute geek for this stuff. I love having access to all the pro tools and features and stuff that are in there. I love that it is now on Android as well. So yeah, my number one pick right now is LumaFusion. Don't forget to let me know down in the comments, what's your number one pick and why? Now, if you wanna learn how to edit in CapCut or LumaFusion, we've got tutorials linked on screen to help you with those. Don't forget to check out the description down below. We've got a bunch of resources to help you with your video creation too. And I'll see you in the next video.